Your T-shirt is ringing. Mobile phones could soon be built into clothes thanks to a breakthrough in laser technology. The frustration of losing your mobile phone could soon be a thing of the past thanks to new technology that could print it on a T-shirt. Scientists have designed the world's first spazer, a nanoscale laser, made out of graphene and carbon. They claim the spazer is so small it will be used to print tiny microchips that can be attached to T-shirts or other items of clothing, and used to power mobile phones. The electrical current in the technology could even be used to target and kill cancer cells within the human body. Other spazers are made of gold or silver nanoparticles and semiconductor quantum dots, said lead researcher Chinakarupa Singhi, from Monash University Department of Electrical and Computer Systems Engineering in Melbourne, Australia. Our device would be comprised of a graphene resonator and a carbon nanotube gain element. The use of carbon means our spazer would be more robust and flexible, would operate at high temperatures, and be eco-friendly. Because of these properties, there is the possibility that in the future an extremely thin mobile phone could be printed on clothing. At present spazers are used to make microprocessors, memories and screens smaller, and more portable. However the new spazer, made using graphene and carbon nanotubes, would be over a hundred times stronger than steel and is a better conductor than copper. It can also withstand extremely high temperatures. Researchers found that graphene and carbon nanotubes can transfer energy to each other through light, and as a result could be used to create a high-tech substitute for microchips. Graphene and carbon nanotubes can be used in applications where you need strong, lightweight, conducting, and thermally stable materials due to their outstanding mechanical, electrical and optical properties. They have been tested as nanoscale antennas, electric conductors and waveguides, continued Rupa Singhi. Researchers also hope the new spazer could be used in cancer research as a new way of destroying cancer cells, as the electric field generated by the spazer can destroy them without harming healthy ones. Rupa Singhi said, scientists have already found ways to guide nanoparticles close to cancer cells. We can move graphene and carbon nanotubes following those techniques and use the high concentrate fields generated through the spazing phenomena to destroy individual cancer cells without harming the healthy cells in the body.